Hey everyone, I want to tell you about Gigabyte's recent partnership with Foley at Home, a distributed computing project aimed at using the power of PCs to help find life-saving drug therapies. We recently announced that we'd be giving 10 high-performance computers, all with RTX 2080 Ti's from our gaming brand Ors, to Foley at Home's labs all across the world to help beat COVID-19 together. In this video, we'll show you why Foley at Home is such an important cause, how you can join Team Gigabyte with your PC and win prizes in the process. To talk more about Foley at Home, I invited one of their lead researchers to talk with us and tell us about all the progress that they've made since COVID-19 started. Hi, Lucy, it's Gideon here from Oris. Nice to talk to you today. Great, thanks for having me. So I'm a researcher in the Folding at Home team. We use Folding at Home to run simulations of proteins and in particular of the proteins uh, of the virus that's responsible for COVID-19. Folding at Home specializes in protein simulation and molecular dynamics. So could you help unwrap that? Basically protein simulations, they're used to understand how the virus works. Mm -hmm. You can think of the proteins as the molecular machines that the virus uses. Mm -hmm. And then simulations, they allow you to understand how the machines move and operate. So if you understand how they do that, right, you can then design medicines that would prevent the machines from working properly. And uh, we have a nice example of this, I think in the spike protein. So that's the protein that the virus uses to attach to human cells and to do that it has to open and then attach and so the simulations basically can help show how that happens and then to disrupt the process if if this is all like one big kind of puzzle how does each uh, individual person turning on their computer uh, and processing these work units how does that contribute to the cause yeah that's a great question so I think the easiest way to think about this is that uh, we're trying to draw a map of how the machine works the, the, let's say the spike. And so then you send out many hikers on the map and each hiker comes back having explored a little part of the map, right? And mm -hmm. so basically then you try to reconstruct the map from the information that each of the hikers has gathered. And so you can think of it as each gamer's computer is sending out one hiker and calculating what the hiker sees and experiences. And then it gives it back to us and then we need to then do the, um, uh, the, the, the analysis and reconstruct the, the full map. Obviously it's since the pandemic started, uh, in that time, there's been a uh, huge support for Folding at Home. Yeah, it's uh, it's been awesome. You know, the the amount of uh, of computer time that we've gotten from donors, from gamers, and also you know regular folks that have a computer in their living room. So right now, we've accumulated really enormous quantities of data, and uh, we're in the process of analyzing these data and you know reconstructing the maps, like I was just mentioning before. With so many people engaging, you know, we've gotten really so much of data that it's kind of a challenge, but it's a good challenge to have. And then another aspect that we're doing is directly looking at how drugs fit into the, the proteins. So you've mm -hmm. placed all these drugs into the molecule, but you have to figure out how well they bind. Is one better than the other to kind of support to help our experimental collaborators? So that's also something we're analyzing right now. My last question is, uh, you know, obviously at Gigabyte, we think that every gamer can make a difference. What do you say to the idea that gamers can save the world? Yeah, I think that's really true and we're really counting on you. So please do that. You know, it's kind of interesting that this crisis might bring out um, something good and uh, it kind of restores my faith in humanity really. So, you know, team up, fold on, gamers can save the world. Hey everyone, now I'm gonna walk you through how to join Team Gigabyte. First, head over to foldingathome.org and download their desktop client. After installing the client, open it and go to the configure section. Here you can pick your display name and enter your team number and passkey. As you can see, I've already entered my name, Gigabyte's team number, 244178, and my passkey. To get your passkey, just click on the blue link to go to Folding at Home's passkey page where you can apply for one. This passkey is important as it's what we'll use to verify with potential prize winners. If you go to the team page, you can see all the current folders that we have with Team Gigabyte, our team number and rank, along with a lot of relevant links. Once you've filled out all your info, you can start folding. Make sure to check out the Protein Viewer so you can see your simulation work in progress. As part of our Gamers Can Save the World campaign, once you start folding, you'll be eligible to win some awesome prizes. Contributors with at least 10 million credits with Team Gigabyte will be entered into a raffle to one of our three newest monitors, the G32QC, the G27QC, and the G27C Gigabyte Gaming Monitors. Those who have at least 1 million credits will be eligible to win a Steam code worth $20. At Gigabyte and at Oris, we truly believe that every gamer can make a difference. Wherever you are, whatever computer you have, you can help find a cure. 
So power up your PC, join Team Gigabyte, and share it on social media with the hashtag Gamers Can Save the World. We invite you to join us and Fully at Home and help beat COVID-19 together. Team up, fold on.